Why do people keep failing funded account challenges? Is it because these funded account challenge companies are trying to make you lose, they're trying to get your money, or is it just a thing inside of your brain that prevents you from passing? You've done the free trials, you've won the free trials, you passed the free trials a thousand times, but once it gets to a real challenge account where you put your real money on the line, something happens in your head and you fail it every single time. It doesn't start going well, you start getting in a hole that you just can't get out of, and what do you do with your Self then I have the perfect solution for you and this is something that when I saw it I was like wow that's that's just a game changer so if you haven't tried a challenge account in the last year you are a lucky person because previously they used to put you on a time constraint of 30 days so you had to get 10% in 30 days which is absurd when the markets do 9% in 12 months so you have to be 12 times better than the S&P 500 it's a difficult task for a lot of people that's why there's so few professional prop firm traders. Last year, I did a prop firm challenge account. I got into a massive hole and then I got onto a major winning streak. Here's a screenshot. I ended up passing the profit threshold, but it was literally the same story every single time I tried a prop firm account. I would get into this massive hole because I'd get psyched out and then I'd turn my brain off and just go back to my default analytics and stick with that and it would do well. It's the start that always screws you over. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments section, but I bet every single time you tried a challenge account, you got into a hole that you never thought you can get out of. That thought alone kept you from winning. What if I told you you can start off a challenge in profit guaranteed every single time? Would you take it? Yeah, me too. So this is my current free trial $200,000 challenge account on Funder Pro. I've taken three trades on here, one baby trade to test the lot sizes and make sure that my calculations were correct, one losing trade and one winning trade. As you can see here on January 25th, I took Australian dollar, Canadian dollar in a buy position for a 0.01, got a whopping four pips out of it and made 30 cents. So I do this not only to test lot sizes, to test that the account works, but also on MetaTrader. When you're in a trade and there's that little X button and you click it because you wanna close it right now, a pop-up window shows up and it says, are you sure? Uh, click this box. And so I wanted to get that whole process out of the way and just have, when I click that X, my trades close out. I always open up every single account with a little baby trade. Then I started trading German 40 because it's what I'm pivoting into. Market failed to make a higher high and I was expecting price to dip down a little bit, a deeper retracement. The next candle didn't do anything except go up against me. So my risk was 1%, which is $2,000. Once it hit half of that risk, I closed it out because I just knew that I was stuck in a trap, I'm going to get out. But what I did instead of freaking out, like, oh, I was wrong. I obviously saw that I was in a trap. So what did I do? I got into a long position because I zoomed the chart out. I took it out to an hourly, saw that we were in a good point in a PD array, took a long position and just wrote it for the day. Ended up getting $3,505.79. Not my full 2% take profit, but I'm going to explain to you why. So as you can see here, here are the three trades and here are the three trades. This is my MetaTrader platform. So as you can see here, market came down, failed to make a higher high. I assumed it would continue down, breaking previous structure. I was completely wrong. The next candle literally went 100% against me. So I closed my trade early at half a percent loss and then took a long position immediately after. I held this trade for one, two, three, four, five hours, and I closed the trade at 2.45 p.m. my time. The original take profit price, as you can see right here, is 17,002. The $2 is to cover spread but I assumed it would go up to 17,000. At this time, I had to go pick up my daughter from school. I did not want to be in a trade, so I just closed it. Luckily, I closed it at the absolute top right there, as you can see, but that's just luck. That's not that I'm some wizard and I know how to get to the top of a swing. No, I'm no. I had obligations. I stopped trading. That's it. It's just a coincidence that it was the perfect time. So as you can see right now on the free trial, I am up $2,461.09. And on the Funder Pro dashboard, same exact amount. Now, on this challenge account, I'm doing well. I'm up on the account overall right now, and it's a good head start. I wish this was a real challenge account. The cool thing that Funder Pro is doing, there's a huge banner up here on the top of your free trial. It says you're doing great. Why not upgrade your free trial to a challenge? Convert your free trial into a challenge today and carry over your profit of $2,500 for a head start on your journey to become a funded trader. Meaning that there is zero risk whatsoever. You can demo on a free trial, 
zero money down. And if you start doing well on that free trial, then you can decide to make it into a real challenge and carry over the profits that you've already made on the free trial. So you start a live challenge account in profit. For me, this is insane. You immediately get that buffer, that cushion. So you can do a thousand free trials, practice over and over and over again until you can do it consistently. And then as you get into profit on a free trial, which costs you zero money, take that profit and move it over into a challenge account. It's going to do the right things for your mindset. It's going to make you think that you can do it, that you can pass because you have a head start. And it was a zero risk investment. All you did was a free trial and you started doing doing well. Carry that momentum. I'm telling you guys, the industry has changed so much. There's no more time constraints. You have unlimited time to pass this challenge. You get to do a free trial, get that free trial in profit, and then transition it only when it's in profit into a real challenge. Absolutely insane. So if you want to sign up for a free challenge on Funder Pro, links in the description, get that thing into profit and then transition it into a live account. If you use the link in the description to sign up, you get a 20% discount. Obviously, I get a cut, but you get a 20% discount. What else can I say? This is a mind-blowing opportunity. Do free trials with zero risk, get into profit, and then use that profit on the demo account to pass your free trial. If you've been waiting to do a funded account challenge, now is the time.